Business news may be her job, but running is her passion. I'll be talking with fair and new balanced Sandra Smith. I'm Chris Ahrens, and this is Media Beat. Look, things change. Anyone with a camera and a computer right now, so you should pay attention to the way we are may evolve. And we are back talking with Sandra Smith of Fox Business Network. Uh, you grew up in Wheaton, Illinois. I did. And you <laughs> end up down in Louisiana. Uh -huh. in Louisiana. Go Tigers. Go Tigers. And uh, you ran track for the school. What did running or being a college athlete, what does that do for you, do you think, in your career? How did it help you prepare? Oh, I think sports do so much for people. I really encourage it. It gives you a sense of team and what it means to be a team and how much more valuable 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 you are as a team player. Um, I think also what sports do is, and what it did for me, was it tested my limits. I mean, one of those was a very simple one that was running every day in 100 plus degree temperatures. I wasn't used to that. Um, but I think it just tests your limits. It, you know, it challenges you. I think it makes you smarter. I think it makes you more aggressive. I think it, you know, really gives you the hunger to be better. I, I think sports are just huge. And I, I know that they did so much for me. And it keeps me running today, which helps. Right. And last year you won the, what was it, the Capital Challenge, the three mile Challenge. race. That's right, yeah. What was the name of your team? Oh, uh, am I supposed to remember this? What was I'm it? I'm gonna tell you. What is it? Fair and New Balance. Fair and New Balance, that's right. right. It was so much fun. Yeah. And I achieved my goal of being the fastest female, what was I, the fastest, do you, do you have that too? Uh, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll get it for the record, <laughs> but yeah, it was fastest female in your category. So congratulations. Thank you. Uh, so you're still running today. What else do you do in your spare time when you, when you have spare time? I, don't, I have a lot of various interests of late. I really, really love cooking. I love reading recipes. I read recipe books like What's a novel. What's your best dish? I have fallen in love with cooking with a Dutch oven. You know, these Le Creuset okay. cast iron pots, mm -hmm. um, short ribs, things like that, I mean, especially in the winter time. Throw a bunch of vegetables in there. It's mm -hmm. fun. Sounds good. All right, we're all going to Sandra's house for, for <laughs> dinner tonight. You're welcome to. Um, you are not on Twitter. Yeah. Why? Um, Social networking. I, I mean, I put some serious thought into the Twitter thing. Mm -hmm. I have so much on my plate right now. I mean, I'm already waking up in the morning and I've got the Blackberry right in front of me and I'm already sending in my topics for the trade segment. And I, I feel like I'm on that thing from five till, well, I'm basically on call all, mm -hmm. all evening. I just feel like it, it would be another thing on my plate. And not that I mind that, but I would only want to do that if I could give it my all and really, you know, because it would be viewers that would be, you know, chiming in and following me. See, I, I do know how it works. Mm -hmm. But I'm, I'm putting it off for now. I'm not saying okay. no, but I'm putting it off for Facebook? now. Facebook? I have chosen not to, I know okay. this sounds crazy. I have chosen to it's not. It's a personal choice. Yeah. Um, it's just, a, it's a control thing, too. Yeah. I want to have full control of my environment. And I feel like, you know, unless I gave it 100% of my attention, I wouldn't have full control of that, of the social networking site. So, but I mean, it's still a thought. Right. And you would have less time with your Dutch oven. I, I know. <laughs> I know. Believe it or not, cooking is very time consuming. Yeah, it is. We've been talking with Sandra Smith, correspondent at Fox Business Network. You can watch her all day on Fox Business from Chicago, from New York, of yes. course, on Hannity, on Red Eye. So we'll be watching for you. Thanks so much Thank for joining you. us.